In this video, we'll answer the question whether acetic acid, CH3COOH, is an electrolyte or a non-electrolyte. The first thing we want to look at is with acetic acid, it's often written this way, but sometimes it'll be written HC2H3O2. So this is another way to write acetic acid. It's the same thing, just written a little bit different. So here's our structure. And if you look at the COOH, this is a carboxylic acid. That's this part right here of our structure. What happens with acetic acid is this H here, sometimes it can come off. Not very often, but sometimes this hydrogen, it'll come off of the acetic acid. It'll be positive, so it'll be an ion. And then this whole thing here, this is now called the acetate ion, it's negative. So since we have ions, we have these charged particles, this is an electrolyte. But with acetic acid, not many of these hydrogens will come off of the acetic acid here. So we only have a small portion of the acetic acid here ionized. That makes it an electrolyte, but it makes it a weak electrolyte. It's also considered a weak acid because we have this hydrogen ion here. That's what makes things acetic, this H+. Because we have the H+, it's an acid, but again, it's a weak acid. So. In answer to our question, CH3COOH is a weak electrolyte. It's also a weak acid. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.